we will never part again. Download the Mobile Reader app to read the novel, We Will Never Part Again, Full Story Online. Chapter 1, The Bitter Truth Fuck you, Grace. Maeve Wright yelled, the veins in her forehead throbbing. She badly wanted to strangle the woman in front of her and send her to hell. However, there was nothing she could do as two strong men had already tied her up. Grace Wright flipped her hair back and folded her arms. With a look of disdain, she uttered, Shout all you want, bitch. No one will come to save you. Why? Because the only person who loved you is dead. And it's all your fault. These words pierced Maeve's heart like a thousand sharp knives. Some time ago, she was forced to marry Dominic Mason for the good of her family. She didn't love him, so she couldn't bring herself to allow him to touch her or get anywhere near her. She even did all kinds of things to hurt him. Even if he died trying to save her from a burning house, she felt he deserved it. All that changed today. Today, Maeve finally realized that Dominic who always seemed so cold and ruthless was actually deeply in love with her. Regret tore her from the inside. She regretted doing all the terrible things she did and also failing to see Dominic's kindness. Dominic can't die. He must still be alive. Although Maeve had seen Dominic dart into the raging fire with her own eyes, she still held out hope that he had somehow made it out alive and would show up in time to save her yet again. Is Dominic Superman to you? Do you seriously believe he's still alive after walking into a fire that big? Grace's eyes narrowed to slits and a sinister smile appeared on her mouth as she added, Well, Dominic did survive the fire. By the time he was brought out of the house, his entire body was burnt and his life was hanging by a thread. It might interest you to know that he was still worried about you in that state. Gosh! What a pity that the most handsome man in Moorhurst reduced himself to nothing just for a woman who never loved him. Maeve's eyes widened in horror. In her mind's eye, she saw how the flames roasted Dominic alive, destroying his handsome face and his skin. And all for what? Just to save her. This made her heart ache like never before. She wished she could turn back the hands of time now. If she could see him, she would apologize profusely. She wouldn't care even if he was a top gun in the world of criminals. Anyways, he's gone. But you know what? What killed Dominic wasn't exactly the fourth degree burns. It's actually you. No way. That's not true. Maeve shook her head repeatedly. Dominic can't die. He's still alive. He must be. Ha ha ha. Grace laughed out loud and pointed as if Maeve was the biggest idiot she had ever seen. Dominic's blood type is very rare. It has the RH negative trait. The blood bank he prepared for himself was emptied just to save you. You don't believe me? Think about it. How do you think you were able to survive that accident? Indeed, the truth was bitter. This fact left Maeve stunned. She also had the RH negative blood trait. She remembered she had been in dire need of blood when she got into a car accident not too long ago. The doctor complained that no blood in store matched hers. But strangely, she was able to receive blood supply shortly after. It wasn't until now that she realized what had happened. Dominic gave the doctor access to his own blood bank. So, you see. 
Dominic is dead. Grace kept talking, causing Maeve to almost go crazy. Her knees buckled and she would have collapsed if not for the men holding her. And now, it's your turn. Once you are gone, I'll inherit everything Dominic owns and become the most respected person in Moorhurst. People will bow down to me, and me alone. Maeve was so hurt and desperate that she paid no mind to Grace's words. Everything Dominic did for her flashed through her mind. Although he was a naturally cold man and didn't know how to express himself properly, he did wonderful things to show that he cared. Unfortunately, his thoughtful actions went unnoticed because Maeve had been in love with someone else. She was so blind that she repaid his kindness with hostility. It finally dawned on her that she had been so stupid. The only one who loved her used to be right by her side, but she kept pursuing some scumbag who seemed like he was cut out of the same cloth as Grace. Maeve was gutted now. She regretted everything. If she had her way, she'd give up her life just to bring Dominic back to life. He didn't deserve to die. Download the Mobo Reader app to read the novel, We Will Never Part Again, full story online.